Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It's me, Lasty, here. Welcome today to episode number 53 of the Road to Glory. Finger points to the sky. Uh, yeah, the FC 25 Ultimate Team Road to Glory, episode number 53. Hope you're all doing well. Uh, let's get straight into it. I've got to make one little change to the team that you saw in yesterday's episode so that we can get an objective done. And I want to test out this new patch and I need to get the rest of my rivals win. So that's pretty much the focus here today. So, uh, like I said, I need to make one little change to this today, but this is the current squad. It's a rainbow team, 11 different card designs at present. We're going to ruin that just a touch, though, by taking my favorite player, Jack Taylor, out to put Kefren Turam in. Uh, essentially, if I want to get that Nuno Tavares objective done, which I'd, I'd quite like to get the card, um, I need four Serie A players in. And we already have three with DeMarco, with Di Lorenzo, and Turam, and let's bring let's bring the other Turam in as well. Uh, so I, I am now that guy that I moan about all the time that has the Turam brothers. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> we will uh, we'll play some games with this team, see how it fares, see how the patch is. If you enjoy today, hit me with a thumbs up, subscribe as well if you're new, and don't forget that all my social links are down below, like my Twitch and stuff, which is where we are making this video right now. So I've been recommended to test out the 442 uh, defensive. Because I've got Yaya and Kefren there that can both play holding with like a plus or plus plus. So we'll see if, if that like helps me a little bit with my midfield woes. I feel like it will, but I also feel like I'm now going to struggle a little bit more going forwards. Um, we'll just test it out and see if it makes any difference. Guzman Dembele sold uh, just for about the same as we, we got him for. Um, I just wasn't using him because... He, he was good, actually, to be fair. But bringing the Serie A boys back in, I don't need like the French players and stuff. So uh, uh, he can just be sold. So we'll take the coins for him. So eight points needed in rivals. I did play a little bit yesterday. And uh, I got like three or four wins, actually, which is nice. Uh, eventually, after I slowed down my game a little bit, because I was playing pretty terrible, uh, into game one we go. A five back to start the day. A fully gold five back? Oh, no. He's got a purple Rashford. And a... Uh, Team uh, um, uh, player of the month, Lewandowski. Could definitely definitely both be dangerous, to be fair. Yeah, come on, Abedi. Nice. He feels like quite a good card, by the way, so far. It feels like a nice one to get from our 10 win rewards. No, I've got I've got to somehow keep that, surely. Yeah. Silly. Silly from me. Uh, I need to get rid of that ball when I get when I finally got it with Virgil there, I had to clear it. Damn it, man. It was not good. Come on, Toram. There we go. Hey, I actually kept the ball and got, got it clear. Could get an opportunity to shoot here. Yes! Roberto Keane! Power shot plus. Come on. Goal. Virgil van Dijk. Come on. Right, we get a rage quit there. I eventually started showing up uh, and got myself the dub. Excellent. Only two wins needed now, I think, for the week. So the only thing I would change from game one here is I didn't like being on balanced uh, and 50. I like being on counter and high. I like my team to press. Even if it leaks me goals, uh, I think it's still helpful in general. Next up, a lot of gold players today. I'm not expecting it. It's, it's meta. There's there's good players there. Oh, man. A little pace boost from Phil Ford. And... <laughs> I thought they're supposed to patch the keeper so they don't parry it straight out to the player again. Okay, we are up against... Classic good squad. Some very nice players in there. We've got to watch out for that Robbie Keane. We know how good he can be. Cheat code. Oh, no. Oh, stop it. That's a joke. I got a rebound. Me? I got one. Didn't go against me. Unbelievable. Scenes. Oh, 
Got to green them if they've got any chance of going in, you know. Cheat code. Yes. Another quit means that we are just two points off of getting our weekly uh, premium rewards. Love to see that. Next up, big shadowy stadium. Nice team. Nice. Perfect goal, that. Perfect for what I'm trying to do. <laughs> the Yaya Torre. Click the stick, flick it up, bang it with a green time. Yes. Oh, he's getting everything. This is going in. All day. Yep. Cool. <sighs> the gritty. Nice. Nice one, boss. Yeah, this game. <laughs> That was a, a complete rigging. All right, let's try and get a win against this fella, shall we? Next up. Ooh, uh, uh, what a team. Unbelievable squad, actually. Purple Pateas. You still got the ball, by the way. Nice, Robbie. Yes, intricate. Managed to get away from the defender with the Berber spin and just tap it underneath the goalie. Got to be a goal. Oh, I didn't green it. No. Yes. <laughs> that was a bit of luck. I have to admit, definitely lucky. Tiger. Bosh. Green time. Powerful shot there from Turam. I don't think we should be 3-0 up, really. This guy's actually held onto the ball really well. That's got to be a quit, surely. I'm 4-0 up. Uh, hey, my opponent quit. 4-0 at half-time. Yeah, I don't blame you, to be honest. And that should be my weekly wins completed. We've uh, lost so many games, though, that we are literally one notch through Division 4 from where we started this week. That's not good. So Div 4 awards, uh, unfortunately, but hey, at least we've got our 35 points. Can't really complain with that. So I've decided to do the Hero SBC uh, as a way to add a flourish to the end of this episode for you. Uh, so let's do that, shall we? I've got this 86 rated squad. Um, it's helped, obviously, by the 88 Lewandowski and the 91 Rodri that we got in that pack in the store the other day. Uh, go ahead and submit this. I'd like to keep and try Rodri, but I'd prefer to do an, do, do an SBC for a hero and see what we can get. Maybe putting such a high-rated card in will tell EA, oh, we need to give him something good in return. Um, I don't know who it could be, though. But, yeah, we get says from, from the, the pack from that. Nothing really to says about that. Anything we can discard? Yeah, loads of things we can discard. And then the 85 rated squad for the Hero SBC to get it completed. Uh, there goes all of my fodder once again. But you earn it so easily in this game. I'm sure we'll have enough to do whatever the SBC is tonight. Uh, <laughs> in like tomorrow's episode. Here's the base hero pack. So this one's uncapped. It's basically like getting 10 wins in the weekend league, which I'm used to doing now. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm a two times uh, 10 win achiever. Small Electrum players pack then. Get a McGregor. It's not, not really what you want to see. Um, and then the hero pack. What are you thinking? My chat seem to reckon I'm either getting a duplicate, so like a Solskjaer or something, or definitely like a Robbie Keane, because... That means that, I, I mean, I've got a better Robbie Keane in the SBC version, haven't I? So, uh, yeah, interesting. Will we get a duplicate? Will we get someone new? Will we get someone expensive? Will we get someone rubbish, someone great? Only one way to find out, I guess. Let's do this. Um, Centre mid, 
Bane. Oh, that's Gooty. Now, I don't know if he's good or not. But I like the thought of it. What has he got? Incisive pass? Pretty good cards. 86 rated is low. We could have got that in a max 87. I'm going to guess he's under 100k and that people might be telling me this is an L. But I'm not mad at it. I'm kind of looking forward to trying, Gooty. Uh, people in the chat are sort of saying not sure. Small L, small W. Oh, I'm not mad about it. That's That's... The description that I'll give. I'd like to give him a go in midfield. He's not better than Yaya. He's actually not better than Jack Taylor. But he's another incisive pass player. And could help me get some links to La Liga if we wanted to use Mendy and Kunde again at some point. What does he actually sell for? Under 100, like we said. But it looks about 80k. Which I know is definitely less expensive than the SBC. But I'm fine with that. I'm actually quite excited to use him. Has he got four-star skills? He has. Six foot one, four-star skills. Left-footed in the midfield there. I actually think that could be all right. I think it could be all right. It might be a little bit of, uh, you know, just trying to make sure I'm all right. But I like this. I like it a lot. My friends, we've come towards the end of the episode. I hope there's been enough content for you there today. Uh, we end by just uh, packing this Gooty in the hero, the latest Hero SBC that I hadn't done. Uh, it's a, I'm going to say a non-capitalized dub, a small dub. He's not as good as Jack Taylor. He's probably better than Kefra and Turan because I like to have someone that's like a creative playmaker uh, next to Yaya. I'm interested to give him a little go. Um, six foot one with four star skills and incisive pass plus. 88 passing as well. Surely he's going to be threading them balls through to this man up here. Um, so yeah, I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, do me a little favor. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. Cheers. And don't forget to follow me on all my socials. Links are down below. Have a great day. Take it easy. Oh, my thoughts on the patch. I've got to say, I don't really notice any difference. So... There's that. Uh, anyway, I'll catch you in tomorrow's episode. Peace.